How to reduce the file size of a video in DaVinci Resolve? This can be achieved by tweaking some settings in the export section. Let's see how it's done. Now, let me make this clear right away. This is not a straightforward process. Reducing file size will take some experimenting and I've already done that for you guys. So the first method is changing the resolution from here itself. Now, I would absolutely never recommend this method for obvious reasons. Changing the resolution will affect your video drastically, but for the sake of knowledge, it is still an option that one has. Second method is changing the quality. As you can see here, automatic is selected. And if you open this box, you have least, low, medium, high and best. You can select any one of these most probably low and least, export it and you'll see the results. And the third method is the restrict to option. Just select this, whatever number you have here, go lower than that. So I have 1 lakh kbps, right? So I can go with 50,000 or 20,000 or 10,000, something like that. And then see which one gives me the best results with smallest file size. Now, like I said, I've done all the experimenting for you guys. I've exported videos at all of these settings, best, low, least, whatever and 50,000, 20,000 and 10,000 restrict to KBPS. So let's see what the results are. If I go to my explorer, these are all of the videos. As you can see here, this is the original footage and the size of the original footage is 139 MB. Like I said, I had exported least, low, medium, high and best. Now medium, high and best are obviously above original footage, more in size. So we can't really use those, but we have low and least. If I open the low file, and go ahead somewhere where the face is clear. See, you still have all of the details that you had in the original file. Now let's see the size of this video. As you can see here, it's 119 MB. The original video is 139, so this is 20 MB less. And then we have least. If I play least, as you can see, it's totally disrupted. Everything is pixelated. You can't really use this. So least is not an option and MB change is drastic like 139 to 11 MB. We can't use it. So from least, low, medium, high and best, the best option we have is low. Then we have got the restrict to option. We have got 10,000, 20,000 and 50,000. Obviously 50,000, 296 MB we can't use. So we have 20,000 and 10,000. If you open 20,000, as you can see here, the size is 117 MB. I'll open it. And again, we still have all of the facial results right here. So the clarity is still great. It's pretty good video, right? If I close it, the size is 117 MB. It's 22 MB is lesser, which is fine. And then finally, we have 10,000, which is 57 MB. Now that is a huge change in size. But if I play this video, and again, we go to that same point, as you can see, we still have the details. And the video is still pretty good. I'll play it again from you from the beginning. See. There's a whole lot of details that have been preserved and it doesn't look that compressed as well, right? So I think 10,000 is the best from 50, 20 and 10. Now one thing to note is that these results will vary from video to video and like I said, you'll have to do some amount of experimenting but my opinion is that first and foremost, go with the low quality, see how much MB you get. If you're okay with a smaller MB change like 20 MB is right here, then low is the best option that you have. But if you want a drastic change, go with numbers. Find a number with the smallest value, but the highest output, the best output, and then go ahead with that. So low and the lowest number with the best output are the two options that you have to reduce the file size in DaVinci Resolve. And that's basically it for the video, guys. That's how you can reduce the file size of your videos in DaVinci Resolve. I hope you find this video useful and if you do, make sure you like this video. It really helps the algorithm suggest this video to the needful people. Also, share this video with your friends and consider subscribing to the channel. I post such DaVinci Resolve tutorials, how to tech videos, tech reviews, I stream games occasionally and I post some knowledgeable and informative YouTube shorts. And I've recently launched my website where I'll be posting weekly blogs about the topics which I just told you guys about. So that brings us to the end of the video guys. Thank you for watching the video. I'll see you all next time. Bye bye.